The next item is the review and consideration of an open enrollment exception request. And we actually have two that have sprung up that we have on here. The first one, um, RM, we are recommending that that open enrollment exception request not be approved. The student is no longer living in Toma. She's living with a relative in the Janesville School District. So she should be requesting open enrollment through them, not us. So we've had cases this year where kids have moved into our district from another district and they didn't want to attend here. They wanted to do virtual school. And we've approved that even though they've never attended here. So because she's not really she doesn't lay her head in our district anymore. She needs to make that request through Janesville. So we have communicated that with the family and hopefully they will um, do that. The second request is actually a student who has been attending school in our district since October. When they first moved to the area, they're out in the country in a spot where um, it's out in the boonies so that it could be Norwalk, Ontario, it could be Toma. And so our bus route actually had it as being Toma School District, Norwalk, Ontario had it as being their school district. They recently found out that the student was going to school here and said she's in our district. And then when Mr. Moody double checked the plat map and all of that, it, it became apparent that they should be in the Norwalk, Wilton, Ontario School District. So they're applying to continue her enrollment here. Um, she is, the bus actually was going and picking her up. We're no longer doing that. The parents get her to the closest bus stop and then she um, gets into Toma High School. So we're recommending that you approve that open enrollment request to Toma for the second student. Yes. Okay, so there's uh, a request by RM to leave which yeah, you perceive as being inappropriate since they, they don't even reside in the Toma School District. Correct. And so that you're recommending denial and then ES. Um, it is your opinion they are they do reside in they don't reside they in don't, it, but, the, but we they were approving the open enrollment request to come into yeah. the school yes. district. Okay. I will make that motion to approve ES to come into our Thomas School District and to deny RM enrollment in the school district. Second. Uh, we have a motion and a second then to approve the ES application to come into the school district and deny the open enrollment request by RM uh, to attend a different district for the reasons stated. Any other questions or comments? All those in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed, say no. So um, the request, the request to, the request by ES to come in is approved, the request by RM to leave is denied. Thank you. Can I have the motions? I'm sorry, I heard one of them. Oh, I need a motion. Who had the second? Pam did. Thank you. <coughs> Maybe in the future we'll separate those, especially when there's a approval and a denial, just, just for clarity of Sure. The motion. Does everyone understand? I guess mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, probably yeah. Probably probably is good to do them separately. Separately next time. Okay. 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 Sorry about that. Well, it's, um, 